Hey everybody, it's Nazara with Nazara's Fine Crafts and today I have to go and get some yarn for some projects that I've got going on. Um, Etsy orders actually. I've got a peacock rug and a sunflower rug that I've got to do. So I'm going to take you along with me real quick. Let's see, this thing's crooked. I can see it's crooked. <laughs> so I'm going to take you along with me real quick. And then um, at the end of this video, we're going to go ahead and do the 3,000 subscriber giveaway. So I'll see you guys in just a moment. Hey, you guys. So, <laughs> got the little one in the back. Um, and we are going, he's waving. <laughs> we are going to... A couple of stores, so I need to pick up thread to match some pants, to hem some pants for father-in-law, I mentioned that in the last video. Um, I need, so I need some thread that matches better. Uh, let's see, I need to pick up some yarn for a peacock rug. Maybe pick up an extra skein or two of, I just got a sunflower rug to do, so... Uh, I don't like to run low on, turn that down, it might be better. Um, what is it? Uh, I don't like to run low on the bright color <laughs> that I use for the sunflower rug, so I might pick up a few of those if I see them, if they're on sale, of course. Yeah. They see you. Go ahead and play your games, buddy. <laughs> uh, he loves being on camera. We do Marco Polo with the family, so he gets to do his little debuts there. Um, let's see what else. Boyo, you're good. <laughs> There's an ostrich in my spec. See? Um, oh, and of course I'm doing this, so I turned the wrong way, but. Uh, let's just turn around here real quick. Um, so they pick up yarn, blue yarn, uh, a mossy green yarn, um, sunflower yellow. I'm trying to think what else. Look in the mirror. I don't need to look in the mirror. I'm looking in the camera and I can see you. You're so silly. Um, let's see what other colors, what other things I need. I need to get vacuum sealed box or bags for those blankets that I got to ship out. And then I've got to get a box that will fit them. So I'm going to take you guys along for the ride. We'll see which stores we end up at. So we'll see you in a minute. Okay. So we're here at Joann's, and then I've got a match, sorry, these pants with some thread. So let's go inside and see if we can find them. So I found, this is the lighter color I do my sunflower rugs in. They're only $2.99 for the Caron Simply Soft. The Caron One Pounders, this is the brighter yellow. It's not, it's not on sale, but we've got the five off 35 or 25% off our total purchase thing today. Found Dark Teal, this is Autumn Maze or Gold. Got a nice light frosty green, the royal, and then 
this is the one I was looking for the most. They only had one turquoise or turco, turquoise. <laughs> so we will see. So went into Joanne's. Had to stop off and get. Um, I'm loving these pink lemonade slushies during this hot weather. But we had to stop off and get something um, to eat. But, um, so I got two of the turquoise. I found one of the frosty greens, um, two gold, two of the dark teal. Got two of the soft sunshine, which are um, for my, of uh, the Caron Simply Soft. I have another little clip that showed you all that. Um, I went and put the royalty, or the dark blue back of the, the Red Heart Super Saver and got the Caron One Pounder and Royalty, which is the dark blue still. Um, looking for paint sets for my son. He's really in the mood to paint, so we got a brush set. We got the thread for the pants. But um, Joann's has right now 25% off until, until the 10th of July. Today's the 8th. So you got two more days. Um, got the, I ended up, the total was like 75 or 76 something. So I used the 25% off, which took off $16. So my total with tax and everything went down to 54.61. So that was a decent deal. I saved $32.34 on the yarn. I also got the darker sunflower, two of the darker sunflower patterns. The Caron One Pounders were not on sale, but with the almost $16 I saved, I'm, I can justify it. <laughs> and look, at least I have it in stock. So, but yeah, definitely if you have a Joann's nearby and you need some yarn, that's not too bad of a deal as well as they're having their clearance sales so which they weren't bad on cricket stuff yarn everything I just um, I always have problems at the register with uh, the cashiers not wanting to scan the coupons if I have anything clearance in there so because I guess the register reads it as you can't do this so I have actually separated orders before because of that um, here's all the regular price stuff or sale price stuff as well as you never know what door busters are out there because most of their coupons don't go towards uh, door busters but um, yeah we're heading to Walmart to find um, something for my son to paint. We have watercolor paints at home. We have acrylic paints, all that kind of stuff. I just needed paint brushes for him specifically. And then um, I need to get vacuum bags. You're going through my grocery list in my head with me. Um, <laughs> no, I need to get uh, bags that I can vacuum seal and then maybe a I shouldn't need a box. I have boxes at home. I like to reuse boxes if they're not completely covered in like labels and things like that. Like Walmart's boxes that are blue, I don't reuse those. I might turn them over or like flip them inside out if I have to, but I've got plenty of boxes that are blank there. Um, so let's head over to Walmart. Oh. I broke my handle off. <laughs> All right, y'all. That was exhausting. <laughs> so, um, I showed you a little bit in the store. I couldn't really do a lot of sound, so I got two, um, Caron Simply Softs and Autumn Maze for my Peacock Feathers to Caron Simply Soft in the color Sunshine. These I use for my lighter 
more pastel -y color. Um, sunflower rugs. Got two of uh, these dark teal and they carry on Simply Sauce in Goda, which is just a dark teal for peacock feathers. Got this nice frosty green and Red Heart Super Saver for the peacock feathers. This is for the peacock body. It's Red Heart Super Saver in the color turquoise. So nice aqua turquoise blue color. Um, I told you a little bit more about the sales in the car there. Uh, this is Caron Simply or Caron One Pounder and Royalty. This is for the feathers of the peacock. Feathery chest, I guess you could say. And then two of sunflower and Caron One Pounders for my darker sunflowers. So let's see. And then got some Crayola paint brushes. Those were on sale as well for my boy. Sorry about the bag. And then some thread for stepdad's pants. So I went over the receipt and everything with you in the car. I did find um, some vacuum seal bags to put these blankets in. I might go ahead and put a clip at the end here of me struggling with that because it'll be funny. But let's go ahead and get into the 3,000 subscriber giveaway. So, rules are, this is open internationally. We, um, this is sponsored by me. This is coming out of my stash, things that I've bought and purchased for this. Um, let's see what else. Uh, you have to be a subscriber of my channel. I do check. Uh, you have to leave a comment below, which I'll give you a comment here in a little bit. You have to, and like this video. So, um, it's going to be open for a week. So today is the 8th. So we will give you till the 15th of July, 2021 till midnight of the 15th. So I'll draw the winner probably the 16th or 17th. Um, and we will get that out. Um, the winner will have 14 days to get a hold of me uh, by email. I'll explain all that in the announcing the winner announcement video and then um, let's turn on this light and show you guys show you guys what you're going for here so the storm passed us and everything I'm feeling a lot better put some heat on my ligament pain and all that kind of stuff so I can move around today which is great but um, Let's get into what we're going to give you guys. So this is Baby Bee Cozy Cutest in the color Bashful. It's from Hobby Lobby. I call it Pip Squeak Yarn. I don't know why. <laughs> but um, I don't like the feeling of this. I mean, It's soft. Don't get me wrong. It feels like you were petting a sheep. Like soft and cushy. I just don't like the feeling of it, but it would make a really neat blanket. It's these cute, cute, like, sherbet colors. You got the dark orange, the sherbet, peach, even a lighter peach there, and then light gray and dark gray. But this one um, is made in China. It's a too fine weight. It's hand wash and tumble dry only or lay flat to dry. You use a 3.5 millimeter crochet hook or knitting needles. They're seven ounces or 200 grams. Sorry, yeah. Uh, 741 yards or 678 meters. It's 100% polyester. 
but this would make a really cute stripy blanket for a general neutral one really because it's oranges it's not pinks or anything like that so you'll get one cake of the baby be cute cozy cutesy in the color bashful um, where am I gonna put these right there <laughs> then I have I kind of gone with like really um, ice creamy colors, shall we say? So, uh, except for the gray parts. But this is Yarn Bee Urban Chic. Um, this is the color gray, but as you can see, it's got yellows, oranges, pinks, whites in it, and even kind of a greenish color. So, um, it's got these really neat stripes to it. There's four skeins of these. And then, let's see, three of these down so I can read one. It's 4.5 millimeter knitting needles or 5 millimeter crochet hook. Excuse me. Uh, 3.5 ounces or 100 grams, 275 yards. 252 meters. It's 28% acrylic, 22% cotton. Three lightweight, machine wash and dryable. Um, made in Turkey. But yeah, this is enough. Four of these could actually probably make two. Depends on how big you're going to make them, but two big shawls um, for four skeins of that. Urban Chic. Um, let's see. I've got this really cute ice cream notepad. So the front of it, I'm going to open it and I'll put it back in the package for you guys just to show you. It's a spiral notebook. So the first, the first ones, they're blank, are in the shape of an ice cream. And then the back ones are still, they're still blank, but they're rectangular. So you can use this for shopping lists, uh, work lists, anything. So I know I always have a bunch of notebooks lying around the house. So you can always use notebook. <laughs> so you'll get the ice cream notebook. And then I went on Amazon which I'll link these in this description below also if you want to look them up but I got a pack of three of these and I love them so they're just little shears they're actually oiled and everything they come in this little this little flimsy plastic thing um, if I have time and get around to it I might make a cute little like faux leather sheath for these for you guys but don't don't guarantee that one but you'll get this one pair of little cutting shears uh, it's really nice not to have to be holding the scissors correctly or anything you can just grab it and clip your yarn so one pair of shears there and they're metal that's uh, metal shears so they're pretty durable and they're pretty sharp so that's why I want the sheath <laughs> I don't like these little plastic things all right and then last but not least I did a video um, tutorial or review on these let me get one of my little friends here so I made this little guy and then I made a penguin which has disappeared I wonder who took that so you guys will get a kit of your own that has not been opened. Super cute crochet. So this is by Thunder Press, Thunder Bay Press. Um, normally it's $16.99 US or $22.99 Canadian. So um, yeah, it comes with the book and all of that to make let's see how many 10 different critters right here so we got a koala a bunny a unicorn a sloth a llama a panda hedgehog or porcupine I guess whichever one you want to 
a lamb, a pig, and a penguin. So, yep. So you'll get one kit. So all together you get the kit. You get the shears and the notebook. You get the cake of Baby Bee, Cozy Cutesy, and Bashful. And then the four skeins of the Urban Chic Yarn Bee. So it's all, <laughs> you see how it's all pinks and oranges here? <laughs> it's very ice creamy. <laughs> ice cream shop is what it reminds me of. So once again, like this video, be a subscriber of my channel. I appreciate you guys so much for subscribing to my channel and watching my videos. Um, I should be getting a few tutorials out here soon. I know you guys, a lot of you really wanted tutorials. It's hard to do tutorials um, unless you make your own patterns because you can't, you can't do somebody else's pattern on a tutorial unless you have permission. So, um, or if it's just a time tested, never been written kind of <laughs> thing, but, um, so, and then I need you to leave a comment below. There'll be one winner. I will use the YouTube random comment picker to pick the winner on the 16th or 17th. Um, there's a lot going on that weekend, so, uh, but it will be out one of those two days. Um, and the comment I want you guys to leave is what is your favorite flavor ice cream? Since it's so ice cream shop themed, I was like, why not? Let's do favorite flavor of ice cream. So mine is usually mint chocolate chip or cookie dough. Um, it's been my, I, I don't like mint either. That's the weird part. I don't like peppermints. I don't like, um, you know, like the York peppermint patties or most gums that are mint. So for me to like mint chocolate <laughs> chip ice cream, I guess that's because it's subtle. I don't know. Um, and of course cookie dough. So that's been my childhood favorite ever since. So yeah, leave a comment. Good luck to all of you. Thank you for tagging along with me earlier and I will talk to you guys soon. Bye.